Okay, hello uh, all uh, again. Uh, in this uh, this lesson, we will uh, learn uh, how to uh, include exe file, so executable file, in our project in C++ 2010 uh, builder. Uh, that we can uh, have one exe into main exe file. So for that purpose, I'm just uh, gonna create a little basic application which say uh, message box working and um, those application I will call test and include it in my project that uh, in my project okay now when all is compiled I can run it and it say working okay uh, now I'm gonna go to desktop and uh, copy those my uh, little application through the desktop okay here and go to C++ builder I'm gonna create new console application Okay, leave all the faults. I'm just gonna include my specific header file. Uh, in this header file, I have uh, just a moment. I have a uh, all basic, all basic, uh, all bla uh, basic uh, uh, header headers, input, output, stream, and else. Okay, now let's go to save that. We have to before anything doing. We have to save it in a new folder. Uh, let's say exe in exe. Okay, project saver. Okay, and uh, now go to projects. Uh, and go to right click options. Go to packages. Uh, uncheck this and this uh, this will allow us to uh, stand uh, to be a standalone application which uh, uh, we can use on the other computer okay uh, now we want to uh, include uh, exe file test.exe uh, before that we have to build our project to create a uh, debug folder this will create for us debug folder and in the debug folder we will put our test application. So copy test application, put it in the debug folder. So go to easy ways to go to save as on debug, open new window, paste it here. Okay. And now uh, 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 hold down the shift and press a right click and go to copy as path. Okay. Now back to our project, go to right click and add just paste inside those that you copy okay and we will try to run it by win execute let's say test.exe and run it so it starts our uh, test exe file so now uh, again go to debug folder and just copy your project. I'm gonna copy him and put it in a virtual machine and paste it here. So now when I run it from here, you, you will see that nothing is happened. Nothing is happened. Why? Uh, because we have a standalone application, but we have to DCXE file include in the same directory uh, where is the project.exe. Okay, I'm gonna copy him and paste it here. And now will work. Okay, now it's working. If I go here and delete this r and run it again, nothing has happened. Uh, this TXT file is my s some other TXT file which I have uh, in my System32 application. Uh, that is for this video. In the next video, we will learn uh, how to run from resources from resource file th this TXT file. Uh, that means that uh, we we will create our project to the TXT, which will have inside of him. Uh, test and run it. Okay, and see you at, at the next uh, at the next video. Bye bye.